Hey everybody, what's up? I'm Skylar or Muhammad, and today we're going to be doing a video on Mario Kart 8. I'm very excited to do this one. I've been wanting to record this for a while, but I never had a capture card or any other kind of recording device in the past. But I can now, and I was a little hesitant to, at first to record this because I wasn't sure if it was too late of a game. Like, it's not the newest game out there, but, you know, still fun. I, if you haven't played this game before, I definitely recommend it. It's very fun, and... I, I've been playing this game for a long time, and I still really enjoy it. It's definitely worth your money, and great buy. Anyway, so for today we're going to be doing some single player. Um, we're going to do Grand Prix. Uh, we're going to skip this 50cc and 100cc because it is boring. Uh, we're going to be doing uh, videos on 150cc, and in the future, maybe, but you know, or not maybe, most likely, we're going to be doing some 200cc as well because it is just so much fun. But we're gonna go into 150cc right now. As you can see, I have nobody unlocked here, but I do have the DLC characters. But for the first uh, person I'm gonna be playing as, I'm going to go as the beautiful Princess Peach. And I don't like cars, uh, it's personal preference, but you know. Um, yeah, I just I just like using uh, more female characters, but her stats are pretty good as well, so it's a win-win uh, as well. Oh, I was talking about bikes before. Anyways, uh, I don't have a lot. Yeah, I don't have anything unlocked because this is a brand new person, but I'm going to use this cart. These are my stats, and this is what I usually use with my other accounts. Fun fact, I actually... Um, we're going to do the Mushroom Cup uh, for this one. Fun fact, I actually went to the anime for 2015, and I believe Extra Life Edmonton was hosting a Mario Kart 8 tournament, and I happened to be first place for that one, and I won a bit of uh, Bioware equipment. Um, I think it was about $100 to $150 worth of stuff, but you know, I could be uh, misjudging the price a little bit. But anyways, it was super fun out there. I uh, was racing with a lot of good people, a lot of fun people. And uh, with all that said, we're going to get into these races right now. First race. Um, I don't have the uh, map names memorized, so you know, I'll probably put the map names in the description below. Put on that because I might forget though. Alright, so we're doing pretty good first place right now. Um, and let's hope that's for someone else. Oh, that's for me. Ouch. And the second place. Um, so if you haven't played this game before, this is uh, called anti-gravity mode, where um, whenever you pass over one of those blue platforms, you immediately go into this mode. While you are in this mode, you can uh, run into each other, and both of you will get a speed boost. So uh, when you're in this mode, it's definitely helpful to kind of team up, I guess, with uh, with someone, so then you two can get in front of the pack of people. It's a good strategy, but don't focus too much on it because most of the time you aren't close enough to other people. So I am at first. I probably should have dropped that a little bit quicker. Uh, it's also a good strategy to keep, if you have a banana peel or a green shell or something like that, it's a good idea to keep them on you because if someone gets a red shell or something like that, it's going to be very helpful because you can't you can't shield yourself from a red shell with coins, can you? <laughs> Alright, so we got one more uh, lap to go, and I'm actually very far ahead, so... I'm gonna hope as these... Oh my god, I did it again. Uh, I'm gonna hope as these races go on, uh, people are gonna get closer and closer to me. I actually haven't played this game very much either. I've been uh, uh, really focused on Splatoon for a while. And that's lightning. Um, but, you know, it's, it's kind of one of those games where you don't need to, you know, practice a lot in order to be good at it, but, you know, practice definitely is, uh, or will make you a lot better at uh, the game. Any game, actually, but this is one of them. And that is uh, the first race. I, yeah, like I said before, I do not know the map names off by heart, so, uh, yeah. I, uh, maybe I'll mention them in later videos, but for now, um, probably just in the description. 
Anyways, we pulled off the first race with a first place, which is uh, very good. I believe 15 points in total. Um, and we're going to get into the next next race. So uh, I'm curious to know, uh, what is everyone's favorite map in Mario Kart 8? DLC, no DLC, or um, a any map. I'm just wondering uh, which one do you prefer the most? I actually prefer Riven Road, uh, one of the DLC uh, maps. It I don't know what it is. I just I really like it. And it's very fun. Anyways, let's get into the second race now. All right, so another great boost off the start. We got Duncan. Ow, he actually pushed me off to the side of it. I don't know what he has, but I'm taking the lead, and we're going to go down in here. Um, no one's really close to me actually. I got uh. Oh, that's a wall. I'm gonna drop that and hope Hey, it hit someone awesome. Exactly what I was hoping for. So, um, yeah, I know I don't have a lot of uh, subscribers, I think it's two right now, but uh, uh, as people join along and as. Yeah, there was a bad choice right there. Yeah, as, uh, as I gain more uh, subscribers, um, I'm probably gonna get. Ow, I think I was directed at uh, DK. Anyways, uh, yeah, as I, like I was trying to say earlier, as I get more subscribers, people are going to maybe watch these videos later on. So I just want to know um, if you guys are enjoying my content for Mario Kart 8, and if you'd like to see more, or if you want to see less. Like, I don't want to spam you guys, but at the same time, uh, I might not be able to post videos as much as I would like to. So, I'm not going to have very constant um, like videos, it's going to be all over the place, but yeah, I'm just, I'm just, I just want to make sure that I'm giving you guys uh, what you want, but at the same time I also want to play the games that I enjoy. Uh, if you're not, if, if you did not, oh, oh I'm uh, I'm, if you're not here before, I think I mentioned this just in one of my uh, Splatoon videos, I'm probably just going to be doing mostly Nintendo uh, games. Just because, you know, I like them, they usually don't let me down. Except for, um, Mario 3D World, Pop Top. But, you know, mo most of them are good, and I always enjoy them. Even if it's just a little bit more. Oh, Donkey Kong is trying to get in front of me. I'm gonna get these coins here. Ah, oh, I just barely missed them there. That was a uh, close race there, though, and, um, hopefully that doesn't come back to kill us later. Uh, I don't think, I think... In 150cc, you need to get first place on all four races to get three stars, but we will see. All right, let's get into this, uh, this uh, third race, third of the four, uh, yeah, three of four races, and hopefully we can pull off another first place or second place, and hopefully we can get the uh, three stars in the. Uh, Future. Hey look, it says the uh, map names right there, so I'm still probably going to put them in the description below, but if you have not noticed yet, it mentions them right while the map is loading. Here we are in second place, and... Okay. I love this music in this game. The, uh, the, basically, any, any good game has really good music. And honestly, I love this game so much. It is so much fun, like I mentioned before. And, you know, I've been playing this for a while, so I know a few shortcuts. If I, I, I might not know some actually, and if, uh, if you want to drop some comments about shortcuts, please do. I mean, I, I probably know about most of them already, but I mean, it would be interesting to see if I'm missing any. Definitely be helpful as well. Oh, oh no, that's not okay. We're still on the course though. Come on. Ah, close. Man, I'm cutting these uh, corners a little too, uh, too close. Ouch, yeah, that's another thing about Mario Kart 8. Items play a really big part of it. Uh, in it. Uh, yeah, I haven't noticed that because, like I said, I haven't played in a while, but. Like, you can go from first, like, sixth place, or even last place. Because it's just, you get hit by one thing, and then next thing you know, you got hit by, um, 
a blue shell, then a red shell, then a bomb, then another red shell, then a green shell, and then by that time you're just you're basically out of the race. I'm actually gonna have to go a third uh, third lap. Um, I am aware that there's that one uh, shortcut on this map with the mushroom right at that last uh, corner there. Hey, I hit a, um, I hit Koopa. That, that's who it is. Koopa, Koopa, Koopa. And now he's in third, and DK is in a uh, close second, I think? Yeah, because people actually uh, are getting close, close to me. I played some games, um, and at, at, I played, let's try it again. I played some uh, quick games uh, at Anime 